here is the old panel right here. That's a champion style panel. This is kind of a dangerous panel to begin with. So we're going to get this switched out to a Siemens brand panel. Good morning from Rewired Iowa. I am Dominic. We are currently in Panora, Iowa right now. And uh, we are doing a panel swap out for a commercial business. We have Nate that is already down in the basement right now. We just got done going through some hoops and ladders, trying to get everything figured out for the disconnect. And we are well on our way. We'll come around here and actually show you what's going on. I see Nate is well on his way to getting that fully disconnected. Here is the old panel right here. And it's a champion style panel. Now it's already been listed before where this is kind of a dangerous panel to begin with. Uh, sometimes things don't stay on the way it's supposed to. Lugs aren't supposed to do what they are. And we already had some erosion, some uh, previous wires. So we're going to get this switched out to a Siemens brand panel. As you see, he is working already diligently on this. So with that in mind, we also are getting the grounding done for the water system here. There was none previously on it. So it is for a 150 amp panel. I went ahead and sized it up to number four because that's what I got in my van. And uh, number four will carry up to 200 amps. So we are gonna be doing that. And as he's getting all this punched out, we are gonna get this all set up. Show me the money. All right, so there's that. And then I got one, two, three, four, five. What you need help with at the moment? What I do need, what I didn't realize. Here, look. So we got. Um, because that um, LD um, coming in, I'm, 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 I'm 99 percent sure that this one's it. I am too, but I still. Would feel more. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. Yeah, same. No, I, I agree. Same. All right, I'm gonna keep going on this. Sure.
So as you all can see, Nate did a wonderful job of getting this all pieced back together. That's right. Just need to add the outlet down below so that way we can go and hook that back up. Go and hook the new ground for the water. Land it into the panel. All in all, Nate's done an excellent job. All right. So we got everything pretty much taken care of. We went through, labeled the panel. We got grounding from the water up, over, taken care of. We went outside. We went uh, did an ohm or uh, ohms test on the grounding system. It is only up to 11, so we are good there. All in all, panel swap is complete, and it looks good. Good job, Nate. Yes, sir. We won around, we uh, went and tested all the outlets, made sure everything was on the way it was supposed to be on. Everything is taken care of, went through. Obviously, you know, some of this stuff is, you know, on the way it is. And then of course you got stuff that says no good. So we're not testing the things that uh, aren't on for a reason. But it looks like they made that as a pass through junction because that wire is going directly over to here, which then goes directly over a panel. So at that point in juncture, they went and teed off, went into here, and then went right back out, and then to that four square box, and went everywhere else. Now, if it was up to me, I would try to suggest a rewire because there are some things that are going on here that are completely sketchy. I mean, you see a 10-3 coming on through. That goes directly over to here to the little itty bitty water heater that is on a 15 amp plug that is being fed off of a 6-3 or 8-3 coming from that way and a 6-3 going that way. Now, there's nothing wrong with upsizing a wire on a breaker but there is something wrong with downsizing now with that in mind again we can always recommend to go and change it but until the customer decides that they want to do something different not really much we could do about it of course we did the panel swap swap per swap breaker per breaker it's pretty much all we can do at the point uh, we made the panel safer it is not the old champion series anymore we don't have the corrosion like we did previously, like on this one with the other one. Overall, it's a nicer panel setup. And whatever we do always has a five-year warranty. So with that in mind, we are all done here. Uh, we uh, made the uh, city of Panora all happy. And we are just waiting for the inspection report to come back. But all in all, it was a good day. We are signing off for a day. Say goodbye, Nate. All right. Another day, another dollar. <laughs> All right, guys. We'll see you later. Have a good one.